Here now is Cabinet Roundup by Stacey Carmichael. The Cabinet was briefed on the interventions by President David Granger during the recently hosted World Water Forum and the 24th Inter-American Congress of Ministers and High-Level Authorities. Minister of State Joseph Harmon today said the President was commended by the Cabinet for highlighting the importance of the natural resources of Guyana and the Guyana Shield to the health and well-being of the planet. The recommendation for the sustainable use of those resources in their pristine state and the importance of hemispheric cooperation for the preservation of the patrimony of the Americas were also noted. The Ministerial Caucus on Oil Sector Strategy, hosted on March 21, 2018, which included presentations from a mixed panel of local and international experts, including Professor of Economics Sir Paul Collier and Sir Sridhar Ramphal, met its core objectives. To build high-level awareness of the key issues relating to the oil sector, B, to frame Guyana's key strategic choices related to each of these issues and align on those choices, and C, to provide a blueprint for a sector roadmap to be completed subsequent to the caucus. Minister Harmon said reports that there was an outbreak of measles in Barima Waini Region 1 were patently false, as reported by the Public Health Minister, Valdo Lawrence. An investigation was completed by a technical team from the ministry as well as the Pan-American Health Organization, World Health Organization, PAHO WHO, which confirmed the non-existence of the outbreak. Minister Lawrence said her ministry will continue to work with the regional administration to ensure surveillance of the borders and the health and security of citizens. The media was cautioned about publishing such statements. Government is confident that the U.S. imposed ban on local catfish will be lifted shortly following a revision of the processes. The action by the USA, which in fact was a revision of the rules for import of fish into the U.S., was a protective measure and that Guyana was working with the U.S. authorities to resolve the matter. He pointed out that there were other international markets which remained unaffected. The Honorable Minister stated that the difference in the ways in which catfish was sourced, that is, farm raised is against wild, cat, wild caught and processed in the USA and Guyana and required documentation were the main reasons for the restriction. Cabinet was advised that the Ministry of Agriculture was however actively engaged with the U.S. authorities to have the issue resolved in the shortest possible time. Finally, in the roundup, Minister of Public Security Kemraj Ramjatan has advised the Cabinet that an investigation is launched into the shooting of three alleged bandits on the KTC walls. The Director of Public Prosecutions, DPP, will launch shortly a coroner's inquest in accordance with the Coroner's Act, Chapter 403. For Info Hub, Stacey Carmichael. Mm-hmm.